Hello, I'm Steve. This is Bit of Munch. And for my Bit of Munch lunch with Mr Munch today, <laughs> I've got a pasty. Seriously tasty, but will it be? Chicken Balti Slice. Now as you can probably see, this was a little bit pricey. I know you can get this brand of slice, pasty, whatever you want to call it, a lot cheaper. Um, I know Home Bargains do them, I think they're 89p or 99p, less than a pound anyway. This was 159 because it was from a local convenience store. Um, a little shop I've never been in before actually, I don't know why, it's not far from where I live, just never been in there, I've always walked past it. So I went in, had a look, and picked this up. I've never had this one. Um, I've had the, is it chicken tikka one? Something like that, some sort of spicy chicken one. But I can't remember what it was like, it was ages ago. Anyway, seriously tasty. What does it say? Chicken pieces, onion and spinach in a spicy sauce wrapped in puff pastry. And it is 14% chicken, 4.5% onion, um, loads of herbs and spices and stuff, and 1% spinach. Anything else interesting? Chicken stock paste. Hmm. Okay, so what I've done is what I usually do when I have something like this now. I've got one half cold and one half warm. And the half that's warm has sort of flattened a bit and started to ooze out a little bit. And so I'm showing you the bottom of the plate, aren't I? Um, yeah, that's the half that's warm. Let's see, it smells really nice actually, it does smell good. Yeah. Oh, that'd be alright, it's not that hot. Right, let's try the, uh, the cold half first and see what that's like. Mmm. Oh, that's tasty. Yeah. It's a sort of, how can I describe it? Aromatic sort of curry taste, if that makes sense to you. Makes sense to me. Um, let's have a look inside. See what it looks like. There we go. Not a huge amount of filling. In fact, one corner here seems to be all pastry. But it smells really nice, tastes really nice. Not much of a spicy kick to it, but tastes good. Have another bite. <clears throat> Almost tastes sort of fruity, but there's no fruit in there. It's probably the spinach actually, giving it that. Yeah, that's just what it is, giving that aromatic taste isn't it right let's see what it's like warm I think this is going to be better I think this is going to be a lot better this one warm let's have a go Yeah, that is better warm. Let's open this half up, see what this looks like. If I can open it up, <laughs> without it all falling apart, it's gone really floppy. There we go. All over my fingers as usual. Right. 
That's what that half looks like. That half seems to have more in it, doesn't it? Still a bit of steam coming off it. I like that. Is it worth 159? Probably not. But if you see it in a supermarket somewhere, um, home bargains or Morrison's, but well, you know what supermarkets are. Why am I telling you what names of supermarkets? Um, <laughs> let's have another bite. It's, it's the spinach, definitely the spinach taste you're getting with that, and all the spices. But um, I say it's not; it hasn't got any any heat to it. Well, well, perhaps a tiny, tiny little bit of heat in the back of the throat there, just there, with it there. I don't know. Um, yeah, not worth one fifty nine. But I say if you see it for about a quid, I can recommend that. That's nice. Yeah. I'd buy again, just not from that shop. <laughs> now, next week, I should have told you, this is the beginning of the video, really. Next week, starting Monday, I'm going to do a crisp review every day. And it's going to be the five crisps of Christmas. Difficult to say, isn't it? Why did I choose such a difficult title for it? Oh, well. Yeah, the five crisps of Christmas. So next week, Monday to Friday, you will see a different crisp review. You will also see some other reviews as well during the week. So it's not just going to be crisps. So if, you don't, if you're not keen on crisps, watch because you'll see other things as well. Okay, thank you very much for watching. Clicks his fingers. Don't know why. And I'll see you in the next video tomorrow at 2pm.